All right. I'll let Mason and Woods know that we're ready. They'll be handling this one. Our source tells us that Aldrich is about to move south across Colorado and into northern New Mexico. That's where we'll intercept his convoy. We can't let a former CIA operative run a Perseus spy factory. Let's put this asshole six feet under. I can't believe Aldrich betrayed the CIA. Betrayed the whole fucking country. Phoenix 2-4, this is Phoenix 2-1, 30 seconds out. We're up, Mason. Locked and loaded. Let's go! 
finished. Mason, let's get a picture of Aldrich for the CIA family photo album. For the traitor section. You know, the shitty part. <laughs> Got the photo. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Hastings left Salt Lake City. We tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. in exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't gonna happen. What's the plan? The last read we have on Hastings came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is using an abandoned compound there to hold the nuke. They're working under the radar, so expect moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, skyhook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's ready, let's move out. Adler's late. No, love, we're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Park, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. All teams, we do this fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! Do the honors, Bill. 
I need cover fire. Like fucking clockwork. Take your team right. Copy. Send those closed circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as that. Contact. Bell sweep for mines.
I need cover. RPG on the balcony. behind the counter. Keep looking. Thanks, Park. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Where? Second floor, room 27B. Second floor, center room. Upstairs. Look Let's out. move. Get there, Park. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Bell, use the C4. Second floor. We're pinned down. Move ahead. We'll catch up. We're heading inside. Lazar man the door. Bell canvas the room. Hastings, start talking. <laughs> Perseus was here. <laughs> he shot us. He escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. Give him full access to Greenland. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many Greenlight devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. And blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. 
Time to go, no? Contact! Chopper coming in low! It's gotta be Perseus! All teams head to the roof! Move! Move! Hazard, we got a shit ton of reinforcements circling this contact! I need cover! Doors. Clear! Out of the way! Adler, I got eyes on an HVT. South rooftop. Could be Perseus. He's climbing into a chopper. Take him out! The window! Out the window! Go, Bell! I'll bring up the rear. Fuck me! The chopper got away! Fuck the chopper! She got bigger problems! Down. Don't wait Stop for it. us. This is Brown Team. Don't you have visual? Roger that, Brown Team. We have visual. Fasten your harness, cross your arms, and remember to keep your backs to the wind. Inbound in two minutes. Heads up! Heads up, Fire. You got snipers on the roof. Copy that. Bell, Shit take sucks. out those snipers. They're everywhere. Controlled burst, Lazar. We're low on ammo. Off. I think I'm ready for that drink now. <laughs> Don't ah. leave me, Clark. But we'll have none of that horse piss. Well, 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 well. It'll be a proper drink. Get ready. Here they come. Where's that plane? One minute. Stay focused. I'll tell you what. When we get out of this, I'm by. Now that's something worth fighting. Ground team, this is Skyhook. The zone is hot as hell. We'll let it assist. That will be much appreciated, Skyhook. Roger that. Help us on the way. Roger that. Clear. Clearing the roof now. That's a hit. Bullseye. I can see the plane. Park, we need to hook into the line now. We'll do it in turns. Bell, you harness up first. We'll cover. Go! Take cover! Shit! My legs! Contact in T-minus ten. Nine. The eight. Seven. Six. Your ass, Bill. Five. That was a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks.
Come on, a little further. Sims, get the gurney. lot more than Lazar if we don't execute this next move correctly. We need you to hang in there for one more assignment. I'm counting on you again, Bell. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping Perseus. You always have been. No more half-assing it. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Injecting directly into the brain could provoke seizures, or worse. Damn, do the eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? The memory should begin almost immediately. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam, one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Do not trust Adler. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. The crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You ran forward and picked up an M16. Then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker.
The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. The zip line nearby was the best way back to the team. He wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. No, Bell. You found the bunker by going into the cave. Why is... Sims is in there in 17. out your sidearm and flashlight. Lying, Bell. Start again and tell me how you met Perseus. Christ, what? The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success for being part of enemies. We've got a job to do. Let's up the dosage and run 1B this time. Okay, ready. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently. split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate.
You equipped your shotgun and had a bow with me. That's when you discovered VC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents. Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. This could be the onset of another focal seizure. Don't stop, Bell. Fuck! Fuck! Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here it is. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a fire. The crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged it. path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. You mentioned crossing a bridge near a village. The bunker was somewhere on the other side. Bell, your report distinctly mentions the village as your destination. It doesn't mention a zipline. God damn it, Bell. Why are you contradicting your report? Bell, use the ladder to your left. Bell, the bunker isn't there. Turn back. Now.
firefight, you readied your M16. He stirred up a hornet's nest. He chopped it. Roger that. Chopper inbound. EPA, two minutes. Yes, this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. I don't care if the door was fucking stuck, open it! Park, give Bell another injection. Do it, now! Stop wasting my time with this hallway. What the lab? What the hell is Bell doing in the lab? Bell, forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume the... survive another round. Now you're asking me. Do it. We're not leaving empty-handed. Script 17. Ready. Bell, you've got a job to do. We've been over this already. Skip ahead to the next one. 
The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. You gotta admit I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation won't work. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training is complete. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell. Coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. But where is Perseus? You tell us, Bell. That's what this whole fucking thing is about. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. When the plane leaves trap zone, he's stopping in Duva. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duva alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. We were there. We found you after everything went down.
The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. It was Park's idea to make you MI6. She wanted that bond with you. He even picked up a bit of her accent. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. Are your hands clean, Bell? No. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. I don't think so. You're still holding back on us, and we are gonna get it out of you. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got come a job. We've got a job to do. We've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind the door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the Green Universe, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovets. This is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. There's still one of us. Adler. Right. Yeah. Так точно. We'll leave within the hour. Five years ago, NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine, the Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal they want. Like detonation codes to every green light nuke in Europe. Where exactly is this thing? About 60 miles north of Kiev between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl. It's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. We'll have to drop you in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Bell came through for us in the nick of time. I never doubted it. Adler. Still seeing no activity from our side. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right. Everyone converge on the gate. You 
You sure you're not forgetting something, Bell? There's nothing here. This can't be the right place. We didn't see anything on our side either. It's him! Fucking lied to us! That true, Bell? You pull us out to the middle of nowhere rushes so Perseus can detonate those nukes? I had no other choice but to trust you. What a waste. You actually could have done something with yourself, kid. Comes the mouse. Glad to see you still care. Mind giving me a light? You remember my face, don't you? Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold, but that chapter is closed now. We begin the next one together. You did well. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. 
As if Perseus could ever be an individual working alone. So American. Ah. We'll need a new home now. The Central Committee will be more surprised than the CIA. Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Mm, yet. For humanity. Their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come. There is still much to be done. My God. How many green light nukes did he detonate? All of them, Mr. President. Does anyone know the bombs were ours? Materials related to Operation Greenlight were anonymously released an hour ago, presumably by Perseus. Calls are beginning to come in from across the globe. That son of a bitch. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. Watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire of the United States collapse under its own weight. A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. And if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, then they too will be replaced. Kasim Javali, your former friends killed him. No matter. Kasim was always a weak link, and the chain cannot break. It pleases me that you did not kill Anton Wolko when you could have. There is still a chance to get him back. Find him. You say that Eliezer Azule perished in Cuba. We will not miss that one. His interference with our Middle East assets will be a distraction no more. As for the rest, it was a pleasure eliminating them by your side. Unfortunately, our key asset within the U.S., Robert Aldrich, was killed. Our spiring there is still intact but we will need to rebuild and find new leadership. The death of Major Vadim Rudnik is a terrible loss for post-nuclear Europe. He was to help shepherd in the Soviet-aligned future. Hopefully, we can still move forward without his presence there. The CIA also managed to eliminate one of Rudnik's key assets. The other two will help fill the void left behind. But have no doubt, these are but temporary losses. We are just getting started, my friend. 